my life i've been grinding all my life sacrifice hustle pay the price want to slice got to roll the dice that's why all my life i've been grinding all my life <laughs> i feel good man we live from brooklyn you feel me i'm outside on my way to canarsie projects you feel me rest in peace pop smoke i'm right up the way from canarsie i'm about to go find me a park to go to I got on my little 40 pound weight vest. I'm putting in pain, you feel me? Regardless of what anybody say about Coach Davis or however you feel about Coach Davis, even though you still tuned in, you see what I say right there? You see why I choose to put this middle finger up? You see what that say right there? That say, no weapon shall prosper. So you can say whatever you wanna say about me, whatever, I could never care. I'm, I'm war ready though. Just like every man should be. Listen, man, if you, if you get on YouTube or you do whatever you do and you trying to inspire people and you think everybody is going to fuck with you just because you're doing the right thing, first of all, it's going to be people like OGs and dick suckers like DJ 100, you feel me, that's older and they're going to see young Gs like me that's under 25 and you can tell that nigga, he look like he like over 35 and he making all of these dick sucking videos about me about seven videos i told the nigga straight up i'm like yo you want to talk all this hot shit i'm like here's it i got something for you why don't you do a video call and talk all that hot shit to my face to coach davis face i mean when the people and the other dick suckers on your channel love to see that right i'm trying to help your bitch ass out and make you look more official than you look because you look like a fucking clown to a lot of people I was trying to do you a favor. Let's see if you was gonna keep that same energy on the video call. You know you not. So that's why you, you feel more comfortable in the, in the comfort of your own home. That's why you don't never worry about no trolls. You don't never worry about no trolls. The motherfuckers, they get a kick out of making you feel some type of way if you let it get to you. Cause they really, they fuck with you the same way that everybody else on your channel fuck with you. But see, what I'm learning about trolls is that trolls fuck with you more than the people that fuck with you on your channel because they going out their way to get more attention out of you. They want you to, they want the extra mile from you because I notice like where I'm fucking up at with the trolls is I'm giving them more energy than I'm giving the motherfuckers that actually fuck with me. So if you watching and you notice that, pardon me for that. I'm learning as I go along. I'm new to the internet, you feel me? I'm doing the best I can to hustle and motivate and it's a beautiful thing at the end of the day to even be taking a shot at doing what i'm doing so now like i was saying man if you going out your way to please somebody and make yourself look a certain way and that's not really you know who you are but you see somebody else doing it right and you think it's easy listen man this shit it get hard man because don't get me wrong like I, sometimes i be forgetting that this is the internet and <laughs> sometimes I be forgetting this the internet and I be having to like catch myself like yo these these internet boys I'm like first of all the thing about trolls too is like for instance right niggas know I'm in Brooklyn so when it come to trolls they know they not in Brooklyn so they talk all that bullshit because they know I probably never see them a day in my life that's how that shit go man that's why you don't never worry about them niggas they got the whole situation. Listen, everything is premeditated, right? They got the whole situation planned out and you thinking that they not really thinking straight, but they got the whole shit figured out. They like, oh, son over here, bro. If I know he here and I ain't got to worry about this nigga, I can say whatever I want to say. I, I don't got to show my face. I can make a, a funny looking profile, whatever, with no face on it, like a lot of other trolls do on my channel and talk all that bullshit. You feel me? It is what it is. That's why you just... That's why I just do me, you feel me? And I continue to hustle and motivate the Gs that fuck with me. Listen, and you know, like, <laughs> I just continue to do what I do, man. Like, regardless, and it's a beautiful thing. It's a beautiful feeling. I'm seeing my channel grow. I just got the 2K subs. Listen, for me to get that in five months, I'm appreciative of that, regardless of what other motherfuckers want to say about other channels is doing better than yours. Listen, I'm not in no competition with nobody that got a channel. And I'm noticing, like, I'm not really rushing for all that anyway because more subscribers come with more bullshit from the, the trolls and all that. It's going to be more trolls. <laughs> so, listen, it's all good. 
keep doing what you gotta do regardless of what anybody think about you, what anybody say about you. Reason why I got so much thick skin is because I grew up with my moms doing that to me first. I grew up in my own home with my mom blackballing me towards my whole family. I would tell my family one thing and my moms used her power of her being my moms over me to blackball me to the whole family and make me look like a clown and talking all this bull that wasn't even true. So I learned that from the gate. It'll be your own people's, you feel me? So once you can get over your own people's trying to do all that bullshit, listen, you could deal with any internet troll in the world. <laughs> That's why I'm gonna keep doing me. But listen, man, I just got the, um, this little Canarsie Projects Park. I'm gonna get some money for a while. Salute all my Gs. I just want to check in real quick. Y'all keep doing what y'all doing. I'm gonna keep hustling and motivating. And I'm out, Gs. Salute.